radio. As usual, let's take a look at what happened with the astrology right yesterday. So yesterday was a sideways kind of day, no real dramas, but you can see we had some edges there that we could trade off. Now, as you know, if you don't know, you're new to the channel, right? This is yesterday, 3rd of May. And as usual, I put the astrological hours for when the market is going to turn. And obviously, we're using it with technical analysis. So I mark the technical analysis levels. And when they match the hours, that's when the market is going to turn. So we've got price and time, right? And it's a very practical and easy way of looking at the market. Really, really easy. Uh, in fact, if you know how to do it the way we do it, you would have had early hours of the morning as well all right so yesterday was tuesday right that's correct let's take a look all right there we go so here we are right gold what do we have what did i say for gold the first was 354 and then i had 541 as you can see this is the low right that's 11 we didn't have anything at 11 there 12 o'clock, 1 o'clock, 2 o'clock, 3 o'clock. Now, 3 o'clock is in the middle of nowhere. Why? Because that's the support and that's the support done today. And resistance we noted as this red zone yesterday. Okay? So the market is not there. The market's not there. So we're in the middle of nowhere. So there's not much to trade around here until we get somewhere. Right? And as you can see, it comes up into our red zone when at 5 o'clock. And what did I say? 5.41. So by 5.41, we should stop at 5.41 somewhere. And that's our resistance level. So that would have been a sell spot. Why? Because the market came up into the resistance at the astrological hour that we calculated. And you can see that's how the market came down. And then it came down and stalled where? At 10, 11, 32, which is there. And then as you can see in Asia session, this is Asia, right? This is just today, market coming slightly lower as well, okay? It's nice to see these little things happening. As you can see, right, despite the fact that it wasn't a very exciting day, you can still get in at places where it's safe, okay? So trading like this is really safe because you know when the market's going to turn. Let's take a look at Euro dollar. Let's see what happened there. This is yesterday. Now then, what happened here? Let's see, that's 12 o'clock. Well, we don't have anything at 12. We need to come to 3 p.m. That's your 3 p.m., right? Look, 3.54, I said 3.54, and that's pretty much 3.54, and that's where the market closed yesterday, and that's 4 o'clock opening, right? So the market turns around and comes down. Isn't that nice? Exactly on the dot, right? So that's a nice 50 point drop there, over 50 pips, but no worries. So you could have taken 40, 50 there. And then what? And then we had five, six, let's see, three o'clock there, four o'clock, five o'clock, six o'clock there. So nothing really exciting there. That's in the middle of nowhere. Market makes it slightly lower. And then we stick around here till 10, 11, and that's it, basically. Okay, that's a nice, decent fall for an intraday trade. It's really good. And, it's, and, and you know when to get into a trade, so you don't have to be in front of the screen all day long. US 30, let's take a look at this. Now, as you know, this white line in the week, the pivot, I noted that on Monday, right? Monday's technical analysis was a little longer than expected or longer than usual compared to the other days because we had a new monthly, weekly, and a, in a daily chart. So we have to like kind of bring it together so we can pan out the whole week. And then we match the astrology, and then we're cooking. Now then, what do we got here? This is US 30. Now look at US 30. That's 5 o'clock. That's 6 o'clock. So not much really happening here, despite the fact that, though, guys, if you take a look at the video, yesterday's daily pivot was here. All right? So... If you're, if you're a keen follower of the market, let's turn this into a five-minute chart, right? Now, as you know, when we're trading indices, we want to look out for the U.S. hours, right? Because U.S. hours, especially for the U.S. indices, that's where all the movement's going to be, right? And yesterday's daily pivot was there. So if I take a look at the hours, let's see exactly when the market turned at the daily pivot yesterday. Now, what's this? As you can see, this is 1 o'clock, 1.50, 2 o'clock. we got nothing there. And then we're here at 3 o'clock, 
350. That's where we are. We're still in the middle of nowhere, as you can see, right in between levels. This is today's daily pivot. But look, the market comes down into here at five minutes past five. This is 10 minutes past five. This is 5.45. Okay, and that's 5.40. Market comes in. So off the daily pivot, it's moving up into this direction we're going up into the weekly pivot all right so at six o'clock that's 5 45 50 six o'clock you can see now it's moving up all right so bouncing off the daily pivot coming back into our surgical hours then going to that weekly pivot target there and that's it. And then we're coming back into this zone. So nothing really happened. But if you know where to trade off, right, like the pivot levels and everything, it would have been an okay day. You would not have had a loss. Okay, this is why astrology is great. You can match your time with the price. Let's take a look at Bitcoin. Now with Bitcoin, yes, I said, don't muck around in the middle. Okay, in the middle. And because that's where we're at. And I said, we probably come down to this level yesterday. Now, this was Bitcoin yesterday, as you can see. It was a bit choppy, but if you take a look at what's going on in the market, that's two o'clock, that's three o'clock there, the market breaking down between three, five, and six. It's just coming all the way down until 10, 11, coming into that target zone there. 10, 11, there, there you go. Okay, very nice, as you can see. Okay, so a bit choppy. Wouldn't have really gotten anywhere with this one unless you were in the Asia session and sold in this region. Okay, weekly pivot plus that. Yesterday we had that level that worked out just fine. So if you followed it in Asia, you would have been okay. But other than that, though, it was a bit choppy and, you know, really not being worth being in there. Okay, and that was the analysis for yesterday in any case. So as you can see, once again, astrological hours with your price, they work like magic. Really minimizing your risk uh, and you know, putting you at a much relatively higher advantage. One other thing, we're going to go live on Patreon and Substack. Why? Because our crypto recommendations have been bringing in amazing returns. Now, if you're a member of the Global Trader Club, this is the club zone, right? Very important is our crypto recommendations. And in there, we've got here a bunch of stuff on cryptos, as you can see. We evaluate a bunch of them. And let me tell you, let's see. We're probably the only place which gives you a complete report on crypto, right? For example, this one, right? This is a huddle opportunity. Well, this is for the members, so I don't want to screen it out all here, but um, you will see, let's, okay, I'll do it. Ethereum name service, ENS. At our crypto night or hodling service, right? You'll be able to get into these. And we're going to go live with them on Patreon and Substack, like I said. And the whole idea is that these, recommendations that we do um, in the members area and what we're going to be doing on Patreon and Substack uh, for cryptocurrencies that we've evaluated fundamentally and technically. Now, at a lot of places on the internet, you'll find um, fundamental analysis on cryptos, right? Which is great. A lot of people do that. It's mostly academic, but we're traders. We want to buy it. We want to hold it. We want to trade with it. We want to get some returns out of it and really want to squeeze it you know, to get maximum profit. So a lot of people don't give you those price levels. So what we do, for example, this is for hodling, right? We got a whole report on it, as you can see. Let me, maybe, yeah, we'll keep it at this level here. So we've got a whole report. What is it? What it does? Um, why is this unique? Right, so we've got all kinds of stuff here. And more importantly, Okay, because once we decided we're going for this, right, we're going to be going into it. We give also the charts here. Now, on Patreon and Substack, we're going to be detailing these out. We're going to be looking at levels where we're going to get in on this one. Okay, it's very, very important. So once you buy it, you're going to hold it. And then that will like in the 
medium term, even in the short term, because I'm expecting some good moves um, based on astrology as well uh, with cryptocurrency. So I want to get into these things before they happen, right? Otherwise, it's going to fly and then you're just going to be stuck out there saying, well, you know, missed out on that. So all of these, we have a bunch of these. We have probably a lot of cryptocurrencies you've never heard about as well. Because if I take a look at all the, uh, if I go to the members area, right? And oops, if I go into the members area and I look at cryptos going there and you'll see a bunch of stuff on cryptos, okay? Um, as you can see, bunch of them. We're putting reports on there all the time. So if you're in the crypto night, um, you're just going to be getting these all the time and a bunch of them too. Um, what you need to buy, what you can buy at a really good price and what you can keep for the long term as well. All right. The whole idea is with cryptocurrencies, there are a few ways to make money. One is if you're chasing a dream like, like Bitcoin, but some of those cryptocurrencies will hit skyrocket, right? They'll hit the top, but this is not speculation. This is manipulation, right? Because cryptocurrencies are getting manipulated at the moment. They're not being traded really like other assets like Forex or gold or indices or stocks and shares or whatever, right? So they're being manipulated. So what you need to do is really cherry pick this stuff so that it holds a good future in the long run and you don't get smashed with your money being manipulated going up and down all the time all right so it's very important to understand how cryptos work and if you don't kryptonite membership will be good for you and like i said we're going to be going live on patreon and substack soon i'll share the links as we do that and we'll also be going live trading there as well okay now mercury is going to start going retrograde this month okay so i don't want to start anything while mercury is going retrograde and so i'm going to extend that opening where we do live trades like mid june i guess yeah because in the third of june mercury will start going straight again but it'll have a stationary moment then it'll start turning by the time it gets up into speed it'll take a week or so so we don't want to be doing stuff new during that mercury retrograde period and we're coming up to that like in a few days all right so be mindful i know i'm saying we're starting 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 but there's a time to start everything and we want to pick a good time all right just like we want to cherry pick these so if you're into crypto definitely definitely take a look because the price is really good for this we kept it nice and low um, and it's giving a lot of stuff which you won't find anywhere else. The thing with the Global Trader Club is, right, we're not known, right? I'm always saying we, 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 but it's just like me and the crypto guys now, okay? So the crypto guys are also, we've got a few guys working on crypto and they're really good. And our problem is we do a really good work picking and evaluating all this stuff and nobody really knows about us. So that's how it is. So if you want to get in there with some good information, uh, it's it's good time to to uh, enter crypto markets. This is crypto is staying. It will stay with us. It's not going anywhere. So the sooner you get in there to evaluate what it's all about and stick your head in there, the better it is. All right. In the interim, oh, I saw we got a PDF book on how to enter crypto markets for the members in the members area as well. So if you're new to crypto, make sure download that PDF book. Uh, in the members area so you can you know, take a look at it how you're going to open your wallets and this and that kind of stuff all right in the interim guys have a good day see you later